Why is Christ called the Word by the Apostle John? The Gospel of John begins by explaining that Jesus is the Word, or Logos in Greek. But most Christians are not aware of where this is coming from, and all kinds of theological motifs have been developed trying to explain this in various ways. But what John is actually telling us here is very simple and yet very profound at the same time. John is pointing to the first verse of the Bible, Genesis 1.1. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. John is pointing to an untranslated word in Genesis 1.1, and I'm going to show you this word in just a second, and I'll bet most of you will recognize it immediately. Connected to the word God in Genesis 1.1 is the Hebrew Aleph and Tav, the A and the Z. In Greek, the Alpha and Omega. If we translated this word from Genesis 1.1 using the Greek alphabet, as John did in the book of Revelation, we would read, In the beginning God, the Alpha and Omega, created the heavens and the earth. John is saying that Jesus is the Alpha and Omega, or literally the Aleph and Tav in Hebrew. The very God who appears in the first verse of the Bible. So, for those who doubt the deity of Christ, such as the Jehovah's Witnesses who claim Jesus is merely a God, the Apostle John is not leaving any room for doubt. Jesus is the God of the Old Testament, the very God of creation. Jesus appears in the very first verse of the Bible. And here is the actual Hebrew text, but you need to be able to read backwards. God bless you. Thank you for listening.